Hi, I'm Karmi Shammas, I'm your astrologer. Today I'll be talking about Thursday, the 2nd of uh, September. Today the moon is in Cancer for the second consecutive day, so it should be a good day, favorable day, if you're Cancer, if you're uh, Pisces, Scorpio, also if you're Taurus and Virgo or Virgo. How's it going to be? For all signs, starting with Aries, definitely it's still a long day, it's still exhausting, it still depletes probably your energy. Some things need to be done, uh, certain things need to be followed up, and I think you can do a lot. It's one of those long days, so you have nothing to worry about, just plan it ahead. Taurus, it's a very fast beat day. It's a beautiful day. You will be rewarded with your beautiful, gorgeous, inventive and creative ideas. This is a very uh, productive day and it is one of those enlightening, empowering days. So don't stand still, do something about everything. Everything will be wonderful. Gemini, this is a good day to follow up on your finances, to follow up on your bills, to check all these drawers and see whatever you have left out without paying. This is a good day to reevaluate everything you have in your uh, in your finance book, in your accounting book, and also this is a good day to uh, double check on what on your belongings, on what whatever things you need to get rid of. Maybe you have some leftovers, or maybe you have some uh, uh, some clutter in your house. This is a good day to start uh, fresh and to throw the old. And it does not mean only material things. Maybe it's ideas, maybe it's uh, concepts, things like that. As for you, Cancer, with the moon in your sign, today is uh, a beautiful day for you to make up your mind on something, to be decisive on, th on decisive on something that you've been waiting for. And this is a great day if you've been waiting for an answer, for uh, an email to arrive. Also, this is a great day to uh, turn a page and start a new one. If you want to meet new people, this is a great day. Uh, just be extra careful if you were born on the 16th, 17th of uh, July. Moving to Leo. Leo, this is um, a slow day. You know, it was like that on Wednesday. So today is a slow day. It is a day that will not give you what you want. It will not reward you with exactly what you want. Most probably uh, you will be waiting in lines, long lines, waiting for things, waiting for things to happen. And if they do happen, most probably you will not be that satisfied. Be extra careful if you were born on the 31st of July, 1st of August. Let's move now to Virgo. Virgo, this is a good day with the moon in um, Cancer. This can be a rewarding day. This can be a happy day. Most probably you will feel like you want to go out. You feel outgoing. You feel you're friendly enough. You want to mix and mingle. Most probably someone will, uh, will reach out to you and it will be easy for you to reach out to others. Um, because planet Mars is in your sign, you have to be extra careful if you were born on the... Uh, if you were born between the 14th and the 16th of uh, September. Let's move now to Libra. Libra, this is not as uh, this is not an easy day. It is not the easiest days of all. Uh, it can be upsetting. It can be uh, distressing. It can be a little bit. Um, it puts you in a mood. So you have to be careful uh, about things, especially about your tasks, especially about your responsibilities. Um, but the good news is that planet Venus is still in your sign and it can bring actually, it can attract great news if you were born between the 11th and the 15th of October. Let's move now to Scorpio. Scorpio, this is a beautiful day. It is, uh, it's as if you're anticipating something beautiful to happen and it can happen. Today, Scorpio is, um, uh, it is a lucky day. It will make things different for you. It will make things uh, positive for you and it is one of the good days. It's just like it can be like Wednesday and uh, tomorrow, Friday will be just as uh, as good. So enjoy. Let's move now to uh, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, this is a day to move on, to make new plans, to decide on new things, to invent, to reinvent certain issues. I think uh, Sagittarians today are happy with what they have. They feel satisfied. They feel uh, confident that they can move on with different uh, uh, in different directions. Uh, so this is a good day to um, maybe to introduce something new to your life. So go ahead, Sagittarius, and uh, and amaze us. Let's move now to Capricorn. Capricorn. Okay, so the moon is in 
uh, so the moon is in your uh, is in cancer which is the opposite sign uh, which can provoke some uh, actually some feelings some emotions that can put you uh, uh, on edge but it is not a negative uh, day you know why it's because the sun is in virgo which is something very positive uh, for you so you can make you can invent and reinvent things and i think you can be very uh, powerful just make sure that you're not bossy uh, and you're not imposing your ideas on others especially if you were born on the 14th 15th of january let's move now to aquarius aquarius this is um, a day to uh, have a specific agenda a specific schedule it is uh, a long day and it will help you actually build up on something uh, aquarius you have to make sure that whatever you have today you have to wrap it up try not to push them to saturday and sunday because they can be a little bit upsetting especially if you were born on the 28th 29th of january let's move now to uh, pisces pisces the sun opposes your sign which may bring a lot of uh, uh, maybe distractions or maybe a lot of maybe um, different people of different opinions uh, but the sun which is in cancer will help you out will help you to blend will help you to um, to to enjoy the company of others and it will help you to have some fun so in one way or another i think you're going to have a, a beautiful day especially if you have meetings today they can be very uh, powerful so basically this is it for thursday i wish you all a great day enjoy bye bye